afternoon. Today is Wednesday, November 2nd, 2016, and I'm Mitch Lerger. Hawaii was going to be the host of one of the largest telescopes in the world. Now, maybe not. We have details. And I'm Cade Grigsby. Scientists have figured out why Mount St. Helens is in the wrong place. Your CSN News starts now. This is College Application Week. Our goal is to have 100% of all seniors complete at least one college application to gain experience within the process. College reps and counselors will be meeting with Columbia seniors during the week to help fill out applications. Remember to bring your social security number, updated contact information, your device, and credit card information because some applications are free and some are not. See Mrs. Ms. Talbot in the Career Center if you have questions or if finances are an issue. Let's show Skyview and Nampa High what Columbia's got and reach our 100% goal, Go Wildcats. Attention all boys interested in playing basketball. Open gyms will be held this week, Monday through Wednesday from 5 to 7 and Thursday 7 to 9. Tryouts will be held Friday, November 11th after school and Saturday morning. Also, skiers and snowboarders, the Columbia Snow Team will be having their first mandatory meeting tomorrow right after school in A233, Mr. Neto's room. Veterans Day is coming on Friday, November 11th. If you have a family member who is, was enrolled in any military branch, the Columbia ASB invites you to the 9th Annual Veterans Day Luncheon, which will be hosted in the library. A gourmet buffet Lunch uh, complete with homemade desserts will be served free to you and your military family member during the period 3A from 11.30 to 12.45 in the library. Please sign up for Mrs. Morris in the main office and direct any questions to Ms. Mr. Dion in A101. The FFA auction and dinner is this Friday. Auction from 5 to 7 and dinner between 7 and 9. Stop by and bid on some of the great stuff. Seniors. Senior tux and drape photos will take place Thursday and Friday during government class in the auditorium foyer. If you do not have government class here in CHS at Columbia High School, please just go to the auditorium foyer at your convenience. Picture packets were handed out by your government teacher last week. If you did not get one, please see your teacher or there are extras in the front office. We'll be right back after this. know what reckless driving is? It is the operation of an automobile in a dangerous manner given the circumstances. It could be going too fast for the conditions, having too many passengers in the vehicle, or failing to yield to other vehicles. Did you know motor vehicle crashes are the leading cause of death for teens? Seven teens ages 16 to 19 die every day from motor vehicle injuries. Reckless driving could lead to a fine, driver's license suspension, or worse. Today. Today's high, 62. Today's low, 40. Tomorrow's high, 61. Tomorrow's low, 36. The 30 meter telescope, or TMT, was due to be built in Hawaii, but ran into opposition with indigenous groups, which consider its per, uh, proposed site sacred. Now the TMT's board says a site in the Canary Islands, Spain, could be a potential alternative. The $1.4 billion project will enable experts to study the, the, nearly, or the early universe and peer into the atmospheres of exoplanets. It is one of the many large observ observatories being built, all intended to serve astronomy into the, into the 2020s and beyond. Cloud-free Pacific skies, low atmospheric water vapor, and other attributes make conditions at Moana Kea Hawaii, among the best in the world for astronomy. The site intended for the TMT was just below the 4,207 meter summit of the dormant volcano. For years, scientists have been perplexed about Mount St. Helens and the most active and dangerous volcano in the Cascade Range. Why is Mount St. Helens so far to the west? Has been the question at the U.S. Geological Survey Volcano Observatory in Vancouver. Basically, the volcano doesn't line up with others in the mountain range. The result of a two-year study would help explain the reason. 
The new data shows that magma comes to St. Helens from a source to the east, unlike Mount Hood, which Moraine, Moraine says likely gets its magma from directly below. How far the magma travels are things that still needs to be determined. The SAT word of the day is collusion, which means a secret agreement for fraudulent, illegal, or treacherous purposes. You could use it this way. The fact that all gas stations set very similar prices has led many to suspect collusion by the civil companies. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching, watching, and remember, live, live the Wildcat, Wildcat way. way.